we're in Florida now. Came here to do a Tsitsis workshop, but I'm running. Help out Ryan with a run. Running with the iguanas. I just had to catch that. It's beautiful. Look at these guys. They're everywhere. Try to find some more. Shalom Alechem. I'm Aleski here in North Miami, Florida. This is a water canal, man-made water canal. And there are iguanas everywhere. Like right over here. They're catching the sun. Look at that beauty. I just fell in love with iguanas. I thought I'd uh, share a quick vert. I'm, it's not a real running commentary. I'm holding the phone in my hand. No gimbal. Just want to throw in idea. I'm here to make tzitzis with the soldiers, with the people in Florida, for the soldiers of Israel. And I have two gigs today, if you're in the area. First one is in North Miami, at Base Menachem Shul at 1.30. The second one is at the Bell Harbor at the Shul. You're welcome to join. But for now, a quick, quick thought, very short. My friend Marvin asked me in Shul, how is it that Yaakov deceived Yitzchak and it's celebrated with the blessings of Parsha Soldos? It's a great question. And there's lots of commentary on that. But one sort of a, a, had an approach to that, but one beautiful thought my wife showed me. First the iguana. Here's some more iguanas. Hello, beautiful. Shalom Aleichem. Look at that. This is iguana heaven. And there's more there. They're all over. Anyway, one beautiful thought is from a Rebbe, I forgot which one. He said that the reason that Yaakov had to wear the clothing of Esav in order to get those blessings was to ensure that in all future generations, when a Jew doesn't necessarily act Jewish and he looks like Esav, he's still worthy of blessings. May we all be always worthy of blessings. And alongside me here is Avram Roth, the Chabad's most celebrated accountant. Helps all the nonprofits in Chabad and probably elsewhere too. I just don't know about him. <laughs> and he's hosting me very kindly and graciously in his home and on the water with the iguanas. That's it for today. God bless you.